To campaign 2020 now, Fulton County is adding mass polling locations. Well, it's part of an effort to ensure everyone has the chance to cast a ballot early. Better Call Harry is more from the High Museum in downtown Atlanta. The High Museum of Art is now on the list of mass polling locations, but there are venues even larger than that. Trey lops it. You can thank the Atlanta Hawks for providing the largest polling location in Georgia. Early voting begins October 12th. This time around, Fulton County voters have 30 early voting locations, including Georgia Tech's basketball stadium, McCamish Pavilion. I'm going to vote in person, You're for sure. Person, no matter what? No matter what, with my mask and my hand sanitizer. One reason turnout may be huge, it was nearly one month ago today that the post office got hammered over accusations of missing blue boxes and a postmaster general accused of slowing down the process for mail-in voting. I'm going to vote in person. I'm going to do whatever it takes to, to get out there. The controversy cast enough doubt to physically push Georgians to the polls. In addition to the High Museum as an early voting location, here's another biggie, Georgia's International Convention Center in South Fulton County. In 2020, voters in the state of Georgia will notice one major change. when At Fulton County's Board of Elections website, they've even got a how-to video on using its new machines. Here's the early voting schedule for Fulton from October 12th through the 25th. Check the hours online before you vote. If you don't want to vote in person, absentee ballots started going out on Tuesday. But here's the thing. If you want to bring it like here to the High Museum, you can't do that. You will have to bring it to one of those drop boxes at your polling location. I'm Better Call Harry, CBS 46 News.